Welcome to a new Let's Play with some of our mistakes. Bay. We are back on harvesting the crop in this field. And so we're going to show you the old of the harvest, seeing as it's just a one time video until version 1.1 comes out which hopefully isn't too far down the line and we've also got plans for the series on Little Norton but for now we will just continue on getting these fields harvested and hopefully by the time We've got this all fin all the harvesting finished, then 1.1 should be out and we can get started. On the roleplay series on, on that. Little Norton's going to be an interesting map to try. I quite like the first look on it and it looks like they've done a very good job on the map. And we are almost around the second of the Edlands. John Deere 1175 working very well indeed. Once we get, that's our pull again, once we get all this harvesting done, then we shall concentrate on version 1.1 and Little Norton as well as continuing on with the classic series and with the Greenwich Valley Greenwich Valley is quickly coming up to current time we're in 9 2019 on there so once we get to 2020 and catch up that will be it <coughs> this combine being an old machine it is still working well is 80% full with the combine so we've got to keep a check out now so we don't keep heading forward when the automatic cutout kicks in we get it to 99% full and uh, come to a stop then that will be good this field it is a little bit awkward with having the row of poles heading through the middle of it. And there we are, we stopped. So we shall get the 8210 going. Which is here warming up nicely, ready for us. Once we 
get the trailer pull, we will take it to the yard, tip it in the silo. It is actually full now. Once we get this tank emptied out into it. Stuck there, it's just setting up. Uh, these red rock trailers really are nice little trailers. Uh, once we get around this headland, we will take a split through the middle, and after that, it won't seem long before, of course, it's 10 there on the header trailer. Put the beacon on on the roof. Not far to the farm, so not long getting to the silo to dump it and then come back and get the next load. around this corner, somewhere around the wiggly yard section. There indeed it is. The helicopter still flying around with the tourist trade and the aeroplane as well. And there is our first load. Of the season's harvest. And that is now emptying nicely. There we go. We will now set off back to the field and continue. Getting the harvest done. Seems very quiet on the roads here today. And very quiet, eerily quiet. Got a car coming here now. Just as we say it's quiet, we meet up with the car, the state car there. <coughs> and now everybody's coming together. Yeah, we'll get this, do this harvesting, show you the old lot of the harvest. That way we can. extend the first series of Sandy Bay out a little bit. We should jump back on board the combine. around the field a little more again. Got close up to this telegraph pole this time. We will keep going out. Let that piece up, there we go. And the aerial bouncing well forward when you stop.
then what we'll do, we'll get sorted out around the poles first of all before we concentrate on the top end of the field should be able to get it all done hopefully we don't get too much rain <coughs> before we finish this and got it all bailed up we may have to purchase ourselves a baler or lease a baler to get all this lifted we are going to follow around this bend much more because it is getting close to this post there we go We'll finish all the way around the third headland first. Coming up to half a tank again. See in the tank from here, we have to rely on the buzzer telling us when we are getting full. There is the half full buzzer gun. Probably get most of the way around this last headland, if not all the way around it. Again, since we've had no traffic going past, now it seems like the road's fairly busy again. Uh, it's just been a lunchtime lull, everybody parked in laybys, in cafes having their dinners. seems to be going nicely for us at the minute. If we can get all the way down here, we will empty and then concentrate on the top piece near the telegraph poles, get that worked out. That is now 80% full. We are around the Edland. We will empty this tank out, Let's go up the gear and away we go. Then we sure this top sorted out. Oh, brakes not working properly on the combine. There we go. <coughs> yeah, working here alone, but but anybody working for us. working fine. <coughs> now we need to get ourselves in position where these poles are.
you think these poles are too close together to be easy to work around but First side of the poles done. Now we shall try and get all this out in the middle of the poles. but Not to get this breed done uh, you know, around the poles and everything can work out that around the last of the poles. A couple of more breeds on this side just to leave a bit of an headland area. There's little bits missed here and there on that side where the poles was, but it's fine. again. Uh, it's all coming along nicely at the moment. We will now get around this pole. It should line us up for where we need to be on our next breed which we will take straight through to straighten this edge up. one more breed up that far side to leave our headland, that's half a tank again. This just straightens this edge of the field up nicely for us. And one more breed down this far side. Yes. Field ready to start in the main body. Hopefully everything from here will be pretty straightforward. to get that bottom corner sorted out within today's episode. be worked out. Get ourselves lined up. That is 
100% full, so we're almost full tank again. Especially, we shall put the auger out ready for the tank filling, which is almost full now. aboard the 8210. This tank emptied out. Uh, finish this bottom piece off and then that is where we will leave you for today. trailer up with this, I'm not sure, but uh, but we have indeed, so we will now continue on working this piece out, and the first job in the next episode will be taking the cart over to the store, well, silos, in the tank to get all this in, so we'll get it finished within today's episode. It's getting smaller each breed as well, so it shouldn't be too long getting this all out. Tank is just over, or just under half a tank at the minute, so it's about 40 per cent. today's episode here on Sunday Bay please give us a like give us a share drop us a comment if you're new to Summer Farm Estates and you'd like to see more of the work we do here please subscribe to the channel give that bell a ring it will tell you when we do these farming videos when we do our racing until you join us next time thank you very much for watching and goodbye for now